Fossil of the Day. Ladies and gentlemen, Mesdames and Messieurs, Damas y Caballeros, and everyone in between, it is with great pleasure that we present to you the Fossil of the Day Award here at Club 24 in Poland. For those of you who do not know, the Fossil of the Day is perhaps the most prestigious award we have here at COP. Yeah. It is given each day to the country who is best at being the worst, who does the most to do the least, and who is doing everything they can to make sure we do not arrive at a fair, just, and binding climate agreement. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and the fossil today is decided by Can International, an international network of Many, many climate organizations, many of you are part of it, um, and they vote each day on who's the best at being the worst. So keep your eyes yeah. out, because maybe your country will be winning this week, uh, and perhaps maybe they should. <laughs> but to begin, we would like to begin with our ancient song, which dates back to time and memorial, the fossil of the day anthem, and we would like to welcome, with a big round of applause, our fossil of the day chorus. Instead of a motor, it's just got a coal-powered fire plant 
tent in there, uh, chugging away. And then you find out that there's even more plans to put another cold fire power station in the boot of the car. And then maybe around that is when you start thinking, perhaps this is not the transition I've actually been looking for. Which brings us to today's fossil. <clears throat> the envelope, if you please. Big round of applause for that.
Hello and welcome to this year's first Fossil of the Day Award, an award that's given each day to the country who is the best at being the worst, who does the most to do the least, and who does their very, very best to make sure we do not arrive at a fair, just and binding climate agreement. Today, the first winner at the COP was the Polish presidency. Uh, you know, it's nice that they're ho hosting us here in Poland, but <coughs> we can taste the coal in the air, people. Uh, we can tell that their, their new plans to open up new coal plants and their claims that they have enough coal to last 200 years. Look, Poland, you can't be prioritizing uh, your own energy sovereignty over the life of our planet. You're not setting this off to a good start for the ambition we need to reach what the IPCC report demands if we have to meet, meet the Paris Agreement and stay below 1.5 degrees. Poland, you've got a long way to come if you're, if you're going to do better than this. Stay tuned tomorrow where we'll be giving out the next Fossil of the Day Award here at COP24 in Katowice, Poland.